Hi, this is Ron Mitchum playing the Hunter Call of Wild on PC. Today we're on for Hunger Savannah, Africa, and we're after Diamond Lions. But we've got a diamond, probably Gems book on my left, so we might shoot that <laughs> in a minute. But I'm just going to check down here because we're after Diamond Lions. That's one of my highly, uh, most highly rated uh, trophies I want for the lodge. And we've been doing well recently. I had a Red Deer Diamond uh, Trophy, which I've been after for a long time. Then we had the Water Buffalo Diamond Trophy, so maybe we might get the Diamond Lion uh, Trophy for the Trophy Lodge as well. So we're doing really well at the minute. The effort's paying off. We've got this level 5 Gems Book. I've had a Diamond Gems Book as well, which is a great animal. But we've got a possible one here. I won't really have the Gems Book, but we might as well have a look at him. Uh, shoot this one if we can. And then continue with our hunt. And see what will come along the way. Today, announced on the Hunter social media, was that we're getting true fallows, uh, true racks for fallow deers. It's coming soon, so can't wait for that. I haven't had a diamond one of those, so maybe we should get out there and get hunting them. As um, the social media was saying, it's going to be pretty soon, hopefully. So you want to get out, and if you've got a diamond roaming around, you know about go and get that before. The update comes because that will probably wipe that out and um, so go and try and get that bagged for your trophy lodge and then you can maybe have an old one at the side of the new true rex one when they come out so that's a great update we've also had a big teaser i don't know if you've seen my last video well basically uh there was a hint about a safari lodge uh based in the anagram the whole message uh basically come down to one little uh, part of it and it said a sailed frog someone worked out that that sailed frog was a safari lodge as an anagram very clever it was very quickly uh, solved and I think that is the logical thing so some people are saying we're gonna get an African reserve I think we'll get a new African reserve and a safari trophy lodge to go with it I don't think they'll just put a trophy lodge um, on here Let's see if there's any big ones here I don't think they'll just do a safari trophy lodge on its own, but I might be wrong. There might be something else, but I don't think so because normally they build up two, three, four hints and then announce what's actually coming. So I think we've maybe got a new reserve coming as well. Christmas time, we've had two reserves drop previously as well for Call of the Wild. Uh, about Christmas time, October and I think December uh, previously, which was Parque Fernando and Medved. So. It is time when one does normally uh, happen. I've got to watch it here because this uh, Cape Buffalo is probably going to steamroll me if I'm not careful. I do like the Hunger Savannah. It is one of my favourite um, reserves in the game. I've just got to watch what I'm doing here. I'm going to take the scope off because when you charge, you want to try and get them head on and try and hit him right between the eyes. And with a big zoom scope, but sometimes when you're this close, it's a bit frantic. And if you hit you a couple of times, it's over as well. So you want to carry a med and then just jump out of the way when you shoot him. Sometimes he'll turn on a five pence and uh, <laughs> you'll get caught. So hopefully, as long as it's not a direct hit, you should, you should be good. But it can take some sticks sometimes. They are like the Terminator. And when you get a big group of them, uh, you normally get done over. Oh, another one joins in. And we've got a little hit there. And this is what I mean. <laughs> get away. We're not getting much luck here, we just keep getting uh, body shots. I'll try and hit it from the side. Yeah, that's a fight, that's a kill shot. We'll just go dance around this one for a minute. Right, same on that one. Yep, there you go. This should be both dead now. There we go. So now we've got these out of the way. I was hoping there was going to be a, a decent one there. Uh, something like a mythical. I've had mythicals at this lake before. Or hopefully a diamond. I haven't had a diamond cape buffalo. But we'll go after the level 5 Gems book. What do you think is coming next? New reserves. If there is a new uh, African reserve, whether it be West, North Africa, South, wherever they actually locate it, if it is African reserve, what animals do you want to see? Uh, drop that in the comments. I'd love to see something totally different, like hippos, uh, crocs. What else could we have? Would you want elephants in there? Drop that in the comments. Some people are like, yeah, I want elephants, I want rhinos, they, they want that. And some people are like, no, we don't want that. So that's always the balance you've got to try and get in between. Just drop in a comment, would you like the big elephants and rhinos, or would you not like that if they added it? It's definitely going to be a tricky one, how they play it. 
there is a rhino sort of mission on the hunger savannah but obviously you don't kill it it's been poached so i don't know if they go against the grain and then let you hunt rhinos or elephants i guess that's up to them how they handle it right, here's this gems book got the 338 here's the rest zone as you can see i have had a diamond over here before uh, and quite a few fives so this might be a good area for getting them because I seem to have had a few fives here at this spot so I'd definitely check it out sometimes I like to see on the big animals just how close you can get without spooking them as well it can be a handy lesson here we go right, that's down now will it be a diamond that's not what we're after today not after diamond gems book but it could be a nice trophy to put in if it is a diamond a diamond gems book are quite awkward and that is not a diamond it's a 918 it's a nice animal heart lung but that's not going in the lodge not big enough right where should we go to now we want a diamond lion move down the bottom so this lake is really good for lions uh, you get jackals here as well uh, scrub hares, uh, warthogs, it's a really good lake and I don't know if many people come here actually drop in the comments if you come down here I do like to hear about which specific areas people come but this is where we are and you travel from there we've just been there down to here and this lake is brilliant for lions if you're after lions this is one of the best lakes I've found and I'm not sure if many people visit it because it looks like quite a small lake but it's really good. There's normally about like three to four lions around this area from what I found. Got a jackal down there. But in this area where I'm looking there, always lions there. Uh, where the jackal is sometimes there's a lion and then sometimes there's lions mainly up in that top left corner. I've seen the legendaries there before. But I haven't actually got them there. We've got a blue wildebeest calling. You normally have rabbits in this little field in front of me. Scrub hares. I should say we do need to get some smaller animals for the lodge because we haven't we've got a couple of ducks uh, but no dark well we've got one diamond duck trophy in there and there's a lion it's only a six that's too small oh, we'll go over there we've got a jackal see now it's uh, going away from the lion you know it's better not to mess about with that you will see if you watch animals carefully when the lions are about or predators like pumas other animals will avoid them and it will spook them just seeing if there's any scrub ears about because you do get quite a few round here there's one what's that one and it starts can't get a view on it we had quite a good uh, hunting day today i got a level five moose as well but it wasn't diamond that was on yukon valley what's that that's a three that, that's a diamond it's, it is a potential diamond so uh, I think we'll go and get that <laughs> right we could have a diamond scrub area and that's nice because we haven't got many small uh, trophies in my trophy lodge so we come for lions and we end up with scrub ears <laughs> that's just how it is sometimes you'll come across big animals small animals trophy animals when you're not really looking for them that is just how the hunter works sometimes you might set up something and come back with something totally different but it doesn't matter if it's a trophy it's a trophy if it's something you haven't got as well it's always nice to get something you haven't got i like to try and master all the species not try and be the best at one try and be an all-round good hunter good player of the game and learn everything i will tend to spend a certain amount of time on one species learn what i can from it how they move where they're located how to get them what weapons are the best for them and then move on to the next piece and just do that all the way through everything and then just get a gradually all round good game uh, sense of how to play the game it's good learning about all the different animals as well and you learn things that you never even knew that was in the game uh, I spend a lot of time watching animals for example how they move and some things you don't even realize are in the game you might not see it in a notes uh, when the, the, those animals are added but you might see little things to do like little uh, animations or little things to do when animals are getting chased and all that there's loads of little things like that you don't notice because you're too busy just thinking about getting a kill and but some of those little items that you find are very important and actually help you become a better player of the game so i always try and 
identify little key things with animals when I'm trying to learn about a new species in game or a species I haven't hunted before. I'm just going to try and creep up with it. And then we'll get my shotgun out and blast it. Rabbits, hares, uh, they're not particularly hard to kill, it's just a case of point, shoot, dead with a shotgun. Uh, and they're not really that spooky. So they're not a challenge. The main thing is location uh, and finding the areas where they are located. That That's it really with rabbits. I'm just going to creep down here. I'll try and get a look at it through your binoculars. I think there's two there in this location. Up the top of the map there is quite a few locations where you do find a lot of scrub ears. Uh, I often see them when I'm driving around on my ATV and you see them spook and you see like 10 running around on the roads and stuff. Right, where is he? Was that it? I think I might have just spooked it. Such a great time for Call of Wild at the minute. Lots of content is being made, created at quite a good speed as well. So it's interesting trying to keep up with what's coming out. And we know that there's plenty of content coming out. So it's all great in the uh, Call of the Wild uh, scene at the minute. Lots of players, lots of people in the community enjoying it. If you're not a member already of the Hunter Discord, you should jump on. A lot of us chat every day. Uh, the community managers put in content. Uh, all the YouTubers, streamers jump on there, adding uh, videos and content, and people just chat about tips, um, just general chat as well. You can put in artwork. It's it's really good. Uh, just should join in, uh, be part of the community. It's a, it's a good crack. On the Facebook group as well, it's really busy, and you see a lot of people posting the trophies on there. It's quite a big group now, and you've got obviously uh, Xbox One. PS4 and PC, so there's a big group of players now focused on there. So you do see a lot of content posts on the Hunter Facebook group. Also Twitter, good for getting news, find out about new items. Like I say today, True Fellows was announced, which is great. And here, is it? Is this one? No, too busy wabbling. That's a two. So that's one of them, we just need the other one now. There was a recent shotgun uh, rework, as you can see there with the pellets, which has uh, made it a lot better. I can't say I've done much uh, scrub here hunting. I've, I've killed a couple uh, when I'm just roaming around the reserve, <laughs> but not specifically uh, gone out for them. So it makes a nice change to come for them. I can hear it. They are quite loud. You can hear them thumping when they're coming through grass. Here we go. There it is, I've just seen it. Come on, stop for a second and when you uh, put you in my trophy room, hopefully. If you are a diamond. Here we go. <laughs> Got no chance against that. Not at that range. All right, let's run over and collect it. So that's what you're looking for, level three scrub here. And then you cross your fingers and hope it's what you want, which is a diamond, and it is a diamond. 969, female, 5.56 kilogram chestnut. So thank you very much Mr. Scrubby, or Mrs. Scrubby I should say, you are going in my trophy lodge, look at that, we absolutely destroyed it. <laughs> so that's been a nice surprise actually, like I say that can go in the lodge, very happy with that. Come for lions, got a scrubby, the lions can wait for today, but like I say it's been a good day for hunting, let's taxidermise that. What weapons would you like adding to the Hunter Call of Wild next? I've seen a lot of people mention muzzle loaders recently. I'd love those to be added. Used them quite a lot in the Hunter Classic. Um, also, big bore rifles. Uh, I can't remember your name, but you said it in the comments and I did read it. Uh, so I'm just shouting that out there. What weapons would you like to see uh, added? We could put it just here at that mount, but it gets in the way of the big trophy mounts. So I don't really like it there. So let's put something in here. We haven't got anything in this room. Nice little uh, trophy mount there, chestnut. There go. So left, right. Let's change his pose, or her pose, keep calling it him. So it's been a great weekend for the Hunter Call of Wild. We've had the new teaser, which is a safari lodge, or it could be with the anagram, it seems most logical. Is there a brand new West African reserve, or African reserve in general? Uh, I don't know, but I'm sure we'll see soon. We've got True Rats for Fallow Deer coming. True Fallow. 
so much things and Ron's just had a diamond scrub here another addition to the trophy lodge been a really great hunt really enjoyed it I'm Ron McTube we've been playing Hunt of Call of Wild on PC hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching bye bye